Kabir Hashim of the United National Party said President Maitri Pala Sirisena at a meeting with foreign correspondents tried to justify the illegal removal of Prime Minister Anil Vikramasinghe on the 26th of October. Issuing a press release, he stated that the government that operated during this time period was in no way, quote-unquote, a Ranil Vikramasinghe government. He observed that President Maitripala Sirisena, who headed the National Unity Government, was not only a head of state, but also the head of the government, and that all the decisions that were made by a cabinet that was chaired by the president. Kabir Hashim added that if there was corruption in the past three and a half years, the president has to equally share the blame. He also added that he welcomed the appointment of a presidential commission to look into this period and insisted that President Sirisena would not be made immune to these investigations himself. Furthermore, he responded to the president's statement that he will not appoint Ranil Vikramasinghe as the prime minister in his lifetime even if legally proven that he commands the confidence of the majority of the house. He called this statement out to be, quote, yet another blatant violation of the fundamentals of parliamentary democracy, unquote. He pointed out that the president has no choice but to act within the framework of the constitutional provisions and that the constitution does not make provisions for personal vendettas. He concluded his press release by reminding President Maitripala Sirisena that he has not been elected for a lifetime and that his term as president comes to an end in less than 12 months.